video we're going to show you how to change the membrane. You will need a 5 30 seconds Allen wrench, also a 1 8 inch Allen wrench, the membranes, this will be the J3D MEMTD3. Um, this is what it will look like when you pull it out of the envelope. And this is what we use. Okay, to start off, we're going to use the 530 seconds and we're going to remove the 10 bigger screws on the outer diameter of the membrane. There's no set order to do this in, so we're just going to remove all, all of them. Once you get this tin removed, the membrane will then come off of the main frame. Okay. Now we will move on to the 1 8 inch Allen wrench and we will remove all 20 of the smaller screws from the frame. Okay, once you get all of the screws out, your membrane will then separate and you'll be able to replace your film. So you'll take the film that was in, set it aside, and take your new film. It already has your perforated holes. And we'll put a line it up. And we want to make sure that we leave the bottom frame that has the threads on the bottom. You'll notice here that we have counter sunk holes. That's gonna be the top of the frame. So we will line it up and I'll start with two screws on opposite corners. And now we'll just start those and we want to tighten them. We don't want to over tighten because then it will be harder to remove once you replace your membrane later on. Once you get the first two in, there's no set order, um, you will start then to um, insert the rest. Okay, once you have them all back in and tightened, we're going to now install it back into the machine. Okay, now when we install it back into the machine, we will place it over the mainframe and I will add two screws to each corner. And I'm going to start those. You want to make sure that the hole is lined up. That way the thread will start on the bottom. And notice that this is kind of wanting to raise up. We want to hold it down. That way the screw will reach. Once you get those started, we will then add the rest of the screws into the empty holes. At this point, I'm going to use a star pattern to tighten the membrane down evenly. The frame needs to be below the inner lip of the main frame. Now once you have them all down even, you'll want to look at your frame and ensure that your membrane frame is below your inner lip evenly all the way around the frame. So here I have it down a little bit more on the right, so I'm going to tighten the left hand side down to match the right hand side. And that looks good. So now what I want to do is just go around to make sure that none of these are loose. So this one I almost had to do a full turn. 
So that's what we want to look for. And the membrane is installed. Now we want to make sure that we have a high pitch tone on the membrane. You can also download a, a free app on for Android or the iPhone. The app for Android is called DA Tuner Lite and for the iPhone it is called Once you open the app, you'll notice that we have the hertz here, and it's actually picking up my voice. So I'm going to place this right below the membrane, and thump. And we want to be above 216 hertz, and we are actually at 350. So that's perfect. Now the membrane is installed.